Welcome to this Blackpool Music School video all about the bass guitar. I am using a fretted acoustic, fretless is fine, electric, upright, double is fine, as long as you are tuned EADG, you can play along with this video. So, let's get started. To get the most from this video, you will have need to see in the previous videos that I've posted this week. So, we are playing the 12 bar blues. We'll stick to the first one with four bars of A to begin with, and we're playing in eighths. Now, to get a bit more movement from that, I'm not sure if you can see this, if you were to use the pad of your finger, I'm using that bit, that gives a harmonic at the 12th fret. You're playing actually on the 12th fret, not before like you normally do above it, but you just like that, that string. Yeah, works on all the strings. <coughs> Excuse me. You are not pushing down. You are simply resting your finger on top. So we're going to create a bit more movement with that 12 bar blues by that simple trick. So it's one and see how it makes the song move. That's all we're doing. So. We'll do this one bar at a time. You can only do it on the A chord really because we've got the harmonic here and it's easier to explain. So let's get started, like I said. So we've got one bar, you've got four bars of eight. This is the first bar, okay? So it's one and harmonic, open harmonic. So one bar sounds like this. So again, one bar is one and two and three and four and or open harmonic, open harmonic. So the first four bars will sound like this. Just like that. Now, if you wish, you can just play it open like that. It's entirely up to you. It's how you, you, the viewer, interprets music. Music is interpretive. How you wish to convey music it's up to you. So the first four bars like that would sound like this. First bar. Second bar. Third bar. Fourth bar. Then you just go to the D chord. It's something else you can add to the music if you feel like it. Like I say, you can do it in, you can merely do it in the key of A because we're on the A string. If you were playing the blues in D, you could do it at the D string. Okay, so that's how you can add a little bit more to it. So in the key of A, which we've been playing in mainly, it is open. And that's how you can add a little bit more. So the 12 bar blues would now sound like this. First, second, third, fourth. It's just a little bit of movement in the music to stop it sounding so formal. It just creates that bit of movement, a bit of swing. So, I hope you found this video useful. If you have, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to Blackpool Music School for more videos. The more thumbs up we get and the more subscribers we get, the more videos we will post. So until next time, take care, keep practicing, keep playing, and as always, goodbye. <laughs>